the first day of school. I think that ought to be a national holiday. It is for me. It's one of my favorite days of the year. We're here at Riverside. The kids are flowing in the doors as we speak, and we're starting off our first full year as a SAIS to Education City, uh, which is a tuition-free scholarship for the next 25 years, including these kids when they graduate high school, plus services and supports that we'll be scanning across the district for the next four years. We have, as you can see, we have rolled out the red carpet because we want each and every scholar to feel welcome and excited. Sometimes coming back to school is not always exciting, but we want to make it an event. We want to make it their home away from home and let them know that we're ready with open arms and we want to really just set the tone for an awesome, positive school year. So we want every student here, every scholar here on time, ready to go and ready to learn. Um, we will not turn scholars away, so if they happen to be running short on supplies or need uniform help, we will help them get what they need because the most important thing is that we have them here in time, on time working ready to learn in class. So please, even if you need help getting uniforms or if you need help getting supplies, we are here to help with that. We really just want every scholar in a Riverside seat so that they can work and learn and have an awesome year. So we've got three goals for the district this year. First, we have to continue to improve academically. We're showing gains and we're really excited about those gains, but we got to keep them moving. Uh, the second is to establish a uh, operational excellence standard so that our buildings are as clean as we want them, as welcome as we want them, as safe as we want them, uh, and you know the food is good. So just that it's a really great experience for our kids and their families. And then the third is really making sure that we maintain our fiscal and financial health for the district as well. We are very, very excited about this year, excited about our new building. We are just like overjoyed just looking down the hallway in the classrooms. It's just such a beautiful space. So already the staff have come in early. People were excited, eager, had families stopping by trying to get in and see. And then just the technology, the, the extended learning areas that you see here. We're gonna have kids out here learning. It's just, it's just all new and exciting. Being in a new space makes puts everybody in a feel, just makes you feel good. So everybody's coming in and, and just happy, happy to be here, excited about, um, about being in a new space, in a, in a nice space. With our leadership and youth development model, we wanna make sure that we're empowering students to be leaders. We are working on leadership skills, making sure that they are just not leaders in like their um, classroom, but like they're learning. So making sure that um, we're providing them with those tools that they need to be successful and taking an active role in their learning. They'll be setting goals this year. Um, and it's just cool to see them like learn those leadership skills and for parents to see that as well and see the growth. So we're empowering students to be leaders here at Waverly. As everybody comes in, we talk about, oh, what did you do during the summer? Oh, I did this. And it's basically, we just, we seem a little more professional in my opinion because, you know, we just went through a rigorous task actually like performing tasks for actual companies through our internships. So it's just, it's like, wow, we've kind of grown up. I feel like the summer went by kind of quick, but it was, it's nice to be back. I miss everybody, all my teachers and all the rest of my friends and all the other students, so. I'm nervous. I'm nervous for like the next step, you know, cause this, after this is college. So I'm not really 100% on what the, what's to come this year. Well, the last four years have been a blast, I'll say. I've gotten more confident in myself and like talking with others. I've made actual friends that I'll probably know in the future. It's just it's nice to know that I was in good hands. I got I got told what I needed and I'm here now. Senior, one last year. Well, I just have to say, we have an incredible uh, team of educators across the district in all of our schools. I'm very, very proud of the teachers and principals and all the other educators that, uh, that teach and, and lead and run our school buildings. And families can be really confident that they're going to have a great experience when they send their children back to CMSD.